Hey, 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 you guys. I'm coming to you in the bed because I have a sleeping baby right here. Um, and so, I'm just going to do it right here, right now. Because if I don't, she's going to have me running and I'm not going to get it recorded. So, today I'm actually 11 weeks, 5 days. And tomorrow I will be 12 weeks, y'all. I'm so excited. I actually went and got an ultrasound yesterday. I'll insert that here. Put the heartbeat back on for you. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. But I am so, so, so very excited, y'all. So I've made it past where I had my miscarriage last time. And that's really what I was trying to do before I came on here. And, excuse me, before I came on here and um, gave any updates or anything like that. I wanted to be comfortable and I knew that I would be a little bit more comfortable once I met that, um, once I met that goal, once I met that, so I'm gonna go ahead and get into my update. Um, so like I said, I'm 11 weeks and five days. Um, oh, my ring, I can't stand when it does that. Um, and so I am plus size as well. Um, Sorry about that, my ring was getting on my nerves. So I am 11 days, 11 days, 11 weeks, 5 days, um, and I am plus size. So I've already said that, and I know I'm probably repeating it, but I have to get my mind back where I was. Um, so I'm a plus sized um, person as is. However, from my um, last pregnancy, when I went back, I had lost 30 pounds. And when I went yesterday, I lost two more pounds. And so he's happy about that. Um, one thing that I do not like about my doctor, and I told my husband and my mom next time I go in, I'm just going to say, I'm obese. I know. I'm pregnant. Let's focus on me being pregnant more so. Because everything that I ask is, well, you're overweight. And I know I'm overweight. I, I know. I know. Um, and I just don't feel like I should be constantly reminded Anyway, um, let's go into symptoms. So, symptoms that I have had since the beginning, um, but have really wore off. I had some nausea at the beginning. Um, not even as bad as it was with um, my last pregnancy or my pregnancy with my daughter. Um, and if you knew my last pregnancy, after I heaved a lot. My daughter, I was sick every day. Um, not that bad. And I only really get sick if I do not eat. Um, I have a problem rem remembering to eat. Um, and so my problem is when it's like 12 or 1 o'clock and I haven't even ate breakfast. Um, and I go to eat something. Um, it gets to me. And it makes me sick. Um, two or three times I've threw up because of that. Other times I haven't. Um, so nausea and vomiting has been wonderful this time. Um, headaches is another thing. Um, I have had severe headaches, and my doctor said that was just because of hormone changes. Um, so that's another one. Um, no appetite. I get that a lot. I get that a lot. And you heard me just say I forget to eat um, breakfast a lot of the times, and sometimes I don't eat dinner. Um, But by the time, by the time I do eat, it's classified as lunch. So I, most of the time I eat lunch, but that's when I get sick. Um, I'm trying to think. Tiredness is one that has stayed with me till this far. He said around 16 weeks I might get it back, but then again I might not. Um, I am extremely tired at all times at all times there's nothing that can bring it back i'm just extremely tired at all times um I'm trying to think i have had some food aversions but pregnancy brain which is another symptom has me like what are they um Last two pregnancies, I love spaghetti, and I don't know if it's because my mom didn't bake it. I know because the last time I baked it, I wasn't crazy about it. I don't really like spaghetti. 
um, and sodas. I know you're not supposed to drink them anyway, but every time I drink a soda, I get sick. Um, but sometimes I just crave that burn. I don't know if that makes sense, but I just crave that. Um, so I've been drinking a lot of water. Um, I went and got one of the, um, what is it called? The tumblers that you get at Walmart. They're like Yetis, but they have them in 40 ounces, 40 ounces now. And I went and got me that. Y'all, my husband eats ketchup on everything. So that's what that is over there, okay? Um, what was it in? Yeah, I went and got me one of those cups and I drink about four of those a day. Or I try. To get to 40 a day. Um, my skin has been glowy. Um... Right now, it's not, because I, I put her, call myself putting her down for a nap, and I kind of slept. I fell asleep, too. Um, so, I'm just waking back up. Excuse me. See? You were talking about sleep. Even talking about sleep makes me want to go to sleep. Um, Vivid Dreams is another one. Um... But all in all, this pregnancy has been extremely easy. Um, I'm rooting for a boy this time. And I really think it is because of how easy it is. Um, what was I saying? I did order some dresses. And so I think I'm going to do a try-on haul when they get here. I'm going to order some dresses from Pink Blush Maternity. I am not being in any way, shape, form. Um, God, my brain does not work. Paid for this. Sponsored. There we go. Sponsored for this video. However, they are a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful site. Um, they have plus size maternity, plus size clothes, um, and regular maternity and regular clothes. Um, stuff for the but They have all types of things. Robes for when you get closer to that time. They have all types of things, and I love it. Um, it's it's um, called, by the way, Pink Blush Maternity. Dot com. I don't know if I said that already, um, but I had bought a few things when I was pregnant last time, and they're um, things that I still wear. However, I will say, like the yoga pants, they kind of run um, bigger, so I got a 3X because that's normally what I wear for the length and everything. Um, I'm 6'1". Oh, and by the way, let me say this. I am 6'1", and never have I ever bought a pair of pants that are too long on me those are too long on me i love it i love pink blush i love them um but um pregnancy brain is real yeah but i love them i bought dresses uh, because i'm gonna be pregnant through the winter i mean the summer this time and i'm like i need something that's breathable that i could just throw on and go because it's spring. Well, it, yeah. And I was already, I'm burning up. Oh, my God. It was just like, I had this one romper. And I'm telling you, y'all wore it every day. Not every day, but every time I went somewhere. And for like three weeks straight, I know they were like, okay, somebody tell this girl she can wear something else. But it was so hot. And no matter what I put on, it was just so hot. It was just so hot. So flipping hot. It was just, it's, oh, it's horrible. I just get so hot. Um, what else? I've noticed that my toddler, um, which will be my two-year-old very soon, is, um, very clingy now. Um, and, sorry, y'all. I think that's my AC outside. But she's, she's so clingy, um, now. And what else? My husband is um, eating for two. <laughs> um, he eats more actually than I do. I'm trying to think of anything else. I really think that's it. This is going to be a longer update. But I'm going to try to come to you guys every week. If not every week, every other week. And just do two. It just depends on how my time. Oh, God, wait. On how my time runs. But I love you guys. And it was good to talk to you again. And don't forget to like. Like, comment, and subscribe. See y'all later. Bye.